So you're in an IEP meeting and somebody asks you a tough question. It could be a really informed parent. It could be your principal. It could be an amazing, really small-haired advocate from Texas. Um, and they ask you, like I always do, where are your RDCSs? Where are your raw data collection sheets? What do you do if you don't have them? So I'll tell you a little secret, guys. When you're dealing with somebody like Karen, <laughs> and she asks you for your raw data sheets, and she asks you for additional data or your progress monitoring, or she pulls up your goals and asks where uh, the percentages are that match this and how did you assess it, she already knows you likely don't have it. And she knows that because you have limited training, you have no resources, and you, of course, want to protect yourself, the school, the district, and that's a tough situation. Be honest. She already knows it. Everybody knows it. So when you're asked something, if you don't have it, my recommendation is you accept it and you say, you know what, let's do this different. And what I'd like to do moving forward, what do you think of this? The minute you stop defending something they already know that you don't have and you start moving forward, the great majority of these people will work with you and be supportive, but do not be dishonest.